If you're a busy guy who struggles with your health or getting to your weight loss goal, you're definitely in the right place. Most people buy weight loss supplements without knowing if they even work. Today, we're gonna to show you which ones can help you get to your weight loss goal. But in order to lose weight, you need to be in a calorie deficit. To achieve this, you need to be eating and drinking less and moving more. There really is no substitute for a solid diet and training program. However, here are the five best supplements to lose weight for runners that actually work. So first up is something most people wouldn't consider as helping with weight loss, protein powder. Most people associate it with bodybuilders and building muscle, but the benefits for weight loss are well documented. The body needs a lot of energy to process protein. In fact, 15 to 30% of the energy in protein itself is burned off by the body just digesting it. Back when I was 120 kilos and on my own weight loss journey, the one thing that I always struggled with was feeling hungry all the time. It wasn't until I started to increase the amount of protein in my diet that those hunger pangs disappeared. If this is you, Keep watching. Late at night was always the worst time for me. It'd get to about eight o'clock, dinner was a distant memory, and I'd start getting hungry again. At that time of night, it's easy to go to the quickest, easiest thing in the cupboard, which for me was usually a bar of chocolate or some cheese from the fridge. Great at the time, but 30 minutes later, I was hungry again. A swap into a protein shake left me feeling nice and full until bed, and I didn't need to head back to the cupboard or the fridge. So how does it work? Well, apart from using a lot of energy to digest, protein also takes longer to digest, which helps you feel fuller for longer by increasing the hormones that make you feel full. That's GLP-1, CCK, and PYY. And decreasing your hunger hormone, ghrelin. The benefits don't stop there either. If you're a runner, protein helps you recover quicker, so you're less likely to wake up sore and stiff the next day. It's also the building block for producing muscle. And the good news is, muscle requires more calories than fat just to exist. So by increasing your muscle mass, you'll be using more energy at rest, which also helps you with your weight loss. Plus, who doesn't want a more muscular, leaner physique looking back at them in the mirror? What really works for me is having my protein shake within about 30 minutes of doing exercise, as I tend to get hungry after I've been for a run or trained in the gym. But find what works for you. We find the addition of protein is one of the biggest game changers for the clients that we work with too. Overnight, they're not feeling as hungry and it really helps them stay on track with their weight loss goals. And if you're veggie or vegan, and it's been a while since you tried protein powder, the good news is that gone are the days of your protein powder tasting like gritty mud. In the last few years, manufacturers have stepped up their game. Now the taste and texture of whey protein alternatives is great. Losing weight can be difficult when we're balancing our careers, family, and our health. But I just wanna tell you right now, you do not have to sacrifice your health at the expense of your busy life. A quick and easy way that you can improve your health is by taking a daily fish oil supplement. Fish oils are essential fatty acids, which are also known as omega-3s. There are two really important fatty acids known as EPA and DHA that you'll need to be consuming daily to get the benefits that I'm about to speak about. If you're wanting to fit back into a smaller pair of trousers that perhaps you've pushed to the back of your wardrobe, fish oils could be the answer. Studies have shown that taking a recommended amount of EPA and DHA each day can help to decrease your waist circumference. Also, fish oils can decrease blood pressure and improve your cholesterol profile, which makes you less likely of having heart problems or having a stroke. And fish oils can reduce the symptoms of depression, helping to improve your mood also. You should be taking 400 milligrams of EPA and DHA each day to get these weight loss and health benefits. However, you don't want to be taking more than this amount per day, otherwise you may end up blunting the effects of taking fish oils. Also, be careful when you're choosing your fish oil supplement and make sure that it's got a good amount of EPA and DHA in per capsule. As we've found in the past that we've ended up taking nine capsules to get the recommended amount in per day, which has come to 130 calories and that's not ideal when you're trying to lose weight. So, make sure you do your research and choose your fish oil supplement wisely. Your brain can play tricks on you and feeling hungry is a prime example. Often when your head is telling you you're hungry, you're actually thirsty. This is one of the key reasons staying hydrated is key to losing weight. Mistaken being thirsty for being hungry can lead to eating more. Being dehydrated can also lead to headaches and feeling tired too. So is drinking more water the answer? In part, yes, but if you've ever got to that point where it's one pint in, one pint out, then it might be that your body isn't absorbing the water and it's just passing straight through. Through. Electrolytes are the answer, as you need something to help your body absorb the water that you're drinking. It's kind of like being out in the rain with a waterproof on. All the water just runs straight off. Now imagine being out with just a jumper on. The jumper absorbs the rain and holds onto it. Electrolytes are your jumper. They allow your body to absorb the water you're drinking and help balance the fluid levels in your body. So that means less headaches, less feeling tired, you'll feel fuller, which means you're less likely to snack, and it can help if you find yourself getting up eight times a night
time to go to the toilet. Your body needs sleep for recovery, weight loss, and so you can give your best in your running and workouts. So if you're having broken sleep due to having to get up every half an hour, then adding electrolytes to the water may well help. Electrolytes can also help with your runs too. If you've ever had a glass of water and then tried to go out for a run, it can feel like the water is just sloshing around in your stomach. By adding electrolytes and sipping little and often before your run or your race, you should find that that problem goes away. Electrolytes can also help with muscle function and especially muscle cramps. So if you do suffer with cramping in your legs, it can often be alleviated by adding some electrolytes to your water. Caffeine is one of the most used supplements, commonly coming in the form of coffee with over 400 billion cups consumed each year. But how can this benefit weight loss? Well, as well as boosting your metabolism, caffeine may also help to suppress your appetite, which can be really helpful when you're trying to lose weight. A meta-analysis found that consuming caffeine can help to suppress your appetite for up to four hours. What that means is if you're consuming caffeine for up to four hours after this, you could suppress your appetite and this will help you to consume less calories and help with your weight loss goal. However, you don't want to overdo it on caffeine consumption throughout the day as this can disrupt your sleep and hinder your fat loss efforts. One study showed that a lack of sleep can decrease the rate that you lose weight by up to 55%. However, if you haven't had a good night's sleep, perhaps you've stayed up late sorting the kids out or you couldn't switch off from work, there is good news. Caffeine can help to suppress tiredness. So if you wake up and you feel like you need an extra kick for a busy day at work, caffeine can really help. Also, if you're a runner, caffeine can really help with this too. Studies have shown that caffeine can improve muscular endurance. Improving muscular endurance is kind of like putting a bigger log on the fire. It will burn for longer and you'll get more heat out of it. And what that means for you in your run training is that you'll be able to run for longer because you'll have more energy. So caffeine can be used wisely in your day-to-day -day life. Be careful consuming this too close to bed as it could hinder fat loss efforts and keep you awake. We typically have a 12 p.m. cutoff and then we don't consume any caffeine past that point. So if you're planning on consuming caffeine, the current recommended amounts are 400 milligrams per day, which is roughly around four cups of coffee. Now last on the list, but by no means least, is zinc. It can be found naturally in red meat, shellfish, and legumes such as lentils. But not having enough zinc in your diet can lead to a down regulation in your thyroid, which can slow your metabolism down, which is a chemical reaction in your body cells that changes food into energy. Several studies have shown that zinc supplementation can help increase your metabolism and the number of calories your body will burn in a day. One study showed an increase of 194 calories a day after four months of supplementation, whereas another study showed an increase of 527 calories a day after just two months of taking zinc. And another study found that those following a restricted calorie diet may experience even greater benefits with zinc supplementation. So how much zinc should you be taking? Well, the recommendation is eight milligrams, so start taking your zinc now. The way we look at supplements is that they are the icing on the cake of your weight loss efforts. To get the results that you want long term, you need to be in a calorie deficit while still being able to eat the foods that you enjoy. After all, if you can't stick to a diet, what's the point of even starting? We advocate adding training into the mix, whether that be running, resistance training, or ideally a combination of the two. Where the magic happens is when you work with an expert in weight loss that can give you all the tools and advice that you need to get to your weight loss goal. Having someone that will keep you accountable, be there when you have questions, with a system that has got hundreds of other guys like you, great results is how you make it happen. So if you're thinking, I want to lose 40 pounds because I want to be able to run around and play with either my kids or my grandkids, or I want to be able to go on a beach holiday and feel comfortable taking my top off, or I want to lose weight so I don't have to go down the same path as other family members that have preventable diseases like type 2 diabetes, heart disease, or even high blood pressure. Whatever your reason for getting the weight off is, we can help. And if you feel like you've been on this journey alone long enough and you want someone to help you lose weight, create consistency in your healthy habits, give you the support you deserve and the expert accountability you need, click on the link in the description to talk to us now.